try a CAA lock here. So there's heater, lock, radar, fox. Awesome. So I am back once again in the low level training, low level intercept mission here. And I've uh, definitely come to think of this as sort of my essential beyond visual range to within visual range training, the transitional training from those two. It's always been a weak point for me. Um, I've relied on the fourth gen, you know, a nice clean radar lock to get me to the merge, uh, get me pointed at a guy and get tally on him within 10 miles. Um, and in the Phantom, it's not always possible. Uh, I'm going to leverage GCI to get me Focus, one, one, Chevy, three, one, request bogey dope. Get me uh, within 10 miles of them and ready to try to get tally. Try and leverage Jester as well here. Waypoint one at 40,000. We'll go. Focus, one, one, on station at So I'm just going to point the nose up here, point the radar up until Jester hopefully gets uh, a hit on something here. Zero for 29. So he's 25 mile narrow scope here. So I need to be thinking about my advantage uh, as I approach the merge here. And with multiple bandits, Five, with uh, 22 miles, 3,000. Welcome. All aspect infrared missiles. I'm probably going to be blowing through. Um, it's going to be pretty critical to me to try and reduce their numbers at the merge. And I have to decide whether I want to take a shot with no lock. Next turn point is updated. Oh, Left there's five, 16 miles. If there's two 3, bandits. I might want to try and put them defensive by rippling a couple missiles off at them, making them uh, think about updated to next turn point. pointing their nose somewhere else uh, other than at me with their all aspect infrared missiles. Or I might want to get a boresight lock and do my best to take at least one of them out with a strong radar lock. Uh, before I blow through so that you know, I'm only working with three when I turn back around Okay, tally tally two Foresight mode tally four Let's try a foresight lock here Come on, Jester What a joke So interesting It does seem like that Sparrow tried to track uh, even clock, though I launched clock, right Remember after Jester got a lock. I was trying to shoot that without a lock. Drop the tanks. We've got an SU-25, 12 o'clock, 4 miles. Okay, lockless sparrow shot. Track. Splash, put out some flares. We've got a SU-25, 11 o'clock, 4 miles. This is usually when a missile hits me. We have a 3 o'clock, 2 miles. A Phantom at 3 o'clock. Blowing through, building some separation. Visual flight lead, I think, right there. Or is that a frog foot? Try and use CAA to pick somebody up here. See a parachute down there. Jester, help me out here. Okay. Definitely a frog foot. He's at our 11 o'clock.
I think splash three for me. Well, they're not human MiG-21 pilots who would um, probably not always make these same kind of mistakes, especially if they're in a coordinated two or four ship. Uh, at the same time, uh, I think this is a great, a great training because those those R-60Ms they'll get you, and they're very hard to dodge. I've only dodged a couple of them. Um, maybe other people have some tips, but I've been able to push uh, some some negative Gs right as the missile's coming at my windscreen there um, and dodge them that way but uh, when they're when they're front aspect otherwise they seem to just they'll take you out um, I'm pretty happy we used a uh, lockless sparrow shot you know that's kind of the that's the the challenge is if it's a singleton probably gonna do a poor sight if it's a two ship ones in trail or really high you know not in not in your picture at all somewhere you're probably gonna do a poor sight try and get a single target track if you have a human wizzo and you can uh, put it out to 10 miles you might be able to get a bit of a longer bore sight lock and have some more time for that sparrow to think before you shoot it you got to deal with what you got i'm feeling like i'm doing better i'm just not dying as much and even though i don't always get all the kills uh you know before i run low on gas i'm thinking that this is this is kind of the strategy i need to be thinking about you know live to fight another day for sure all right i'll see you guys next time